Due to deep concerns with the staffing and patient care in the ED, I, or I often would fill out MNA's concern for safe staffing reports. In July of 2022, my manager approached me in a public area of the emergency room and confronted me about my unsafe staffing reports. She told me that two nurses at night in the emergency room was appropriate staffing and I should not be filling out these reports. At one point when she confronted me, this was publicly, she yelled at me and was interrupted by another nurse who removed me from the situation. Knowing there needed to be a change, I continued to fill out these unsafe staffing reports. This manager continued to bully and harass me. She encouraged staff to complain about me. She fished about negative information about me from other coworkers. She complained to my coworkers about me and held multiple investigatory meetings about me, about complaints from patients and or staff, none of which were substantiated. Numerous nurses have left my emergency room, where I, the emergency room where I work, due to this bullying, and have often, it's often centered around staffing concerns. We are often overrun with boarding patients, sometimes waiting days for beds here in the metro. Those patients do not receive the care that they deserve. Um, we do not have enough staff to handle the constant flow of emergency room patients on top of boarding patients. Nurses who bring these issues to management often face bullying in many different forms. They lose out on opportunities to earn more money with precepting or charge nurse pay. And they also see their schedules change without reason. They're constantly harassed by management. So many nurses have left that a large percentage of our nurses at my facility are traveling nurses. And this has been true since 2021. So we need your intervention and your support.